see there's people stopped here too. I screwed up like that. I was just, I realized I was going past it as I was going past it and I was just daydreaming. stuff on the road. That little black kid's throwing stuff on the road. Turn five on solid circle.
mistake really cost me. On a 70 mile an hour road, very annoying. Those kids are throwing snow, but they're not throwing it on the road. Two little white girls. Oh my god, it's locked. They locked the park. Arriving at Lions Lane on the left. Close to vehicle traffic beginning October 31st. Parking on this sidewalk. We gotta figure things out. <clears throat> Thought that guy was going to say something. Oh, he's still backing up. Just keep the camera going, I guess. Ten city trucks that were in and out of that in a half hour. All right, there's a lot of turns here. At the end of the street, turn right. The David Hockel Highway is not even recognized. But at least I got the in introduction of it, so when I get there, I'll know where to go anyway. <laughs> it 
threw me off. I'm like, hey, where's this highway? Garmin doesn't even recognize. Turn right on Hyde Park Avenue. Charles? We're not in St. Charles. St. Charles gets a lot of calls though. got a uh, from what I've listened to St. Charles has got a problem
this is the one. So this is all new. This is a dead end. No, I'm, I'm not even. I'm off the road according to Garmin. You suck! I expect to see a sign that shows where a park is. Not here? People's GPS won't take them down this road because it doesn't exist. All right, yeah, there's a park off to the right. Sunrise to sunset. <laughs> so yeah, this is this is kind of well. This isn't exactly a new park, I guess. Just there's a new road accessing it. There might be electricity. Very unlikely to have a ba open bathrooms. Yeah, I'd, I'd like to be close to that shelter. Oh, going further in, you can't. You can't do that. Huh. Where are they? Yes. All right, Wentzville, nine twenty-three, eleven fifteen. I keep having to put out that oh, propane tank because it's leaking so much. I'm so tired of breathing it in. It's gonna leak itself empty. It's pretty. It's getting there. Definitely feels lighter now. Mm, but I bring it every time it shakes. Every time it gets a little bit of a shake, it wants to go. Shh. I put the cap, plastic cap, over it, but that didn't do anything. The second cap. Just because I'm such a, yeah, I rolled down the window to deal with it. I'm smelling it a little bit. I rolled down the window a little bit just so I can, uh, so some of that gas can escape. <laughs> I guess I'll want to put it outside the car again when I get to Walmart. It's it's like this almost seems like a first time that's happened where I just had such a bad leak with the propane. <laughs> Every time it shakes it wants to off gas for like five, ten seconds and then quit and then shake again. Yeah, that's 
Yeah, Garmin doesn't recognize the second, the new road, so Garmin's only, Garmin's thinking that there's only one road. So, I know what she's talking about. Turn left. <laughs> I'm like, what? <laughs> yeah, talking about this one. Uh, a pretty lengthy road came in and came in after Garmin updated the map. Twenty-five driveways. Well, I hope it's not too bad around at this Walmart. I'm gonna need gas. I should really need a new tire or two. Oh, all the money I'm spending. I don't want to go too deeply into the city, but I want to check it out a little bit. Chuck Berry used to live in this outside city. And he's, he died in 2017. And his house really doesn't look like it was much. From the Google Maps perspective. At the end of the street, turn right. End of the street. It's going to be a really cold one again. I don't know what to think of it exactly. I'm just... Uh, my biggest concern is my car. My car struggles so much in this starting up in this cold. Yeah, I think I'm on a new road. I don't think Garmin's recognizing this road. Garmin might be just saying I'm on that highway. It's hard to, hard to tell exactly, but... There's a few businesses off of this road, though. It's hard to believe that there's... There'd be nothing... That this wouldn't be recognized. turn off is it possible where do I can I this road construction is is confusing me okay yeah, 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 yeah. and I think Walmart's on the left side so I guess Try this. Uh, <laughs> somebody's working on their truck. It's, it's, oh, it's not, it's not going to work out. Well, no, 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 no. Okay. So Garmin always has me going past it. So I'm going to assume that that's a part of the, the directions. And then I did look at the map a little bit. I can't, I think I can go through a parking lot. I 
almost turned into a double stop for me. It's that it's that busy where it almost turned into a double stop. Yeah. No, 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 no. And that person wants to left. Maybe they got a chance. Okay. Yeah, okay. parking signs. Ooh, I'll just tighten it up and make this. Mm, try to be a little distance from the Walmart just to, in case they want to yell at me, make them walk out to reach me. I don't see any blue lights in the parking lot. Okay, I'm in Wenzel, Wenzel 520. All right, this is Wentzville, and I'm going to a gas station first, and then the library, possibly for the day, maybe not. I guess that's not possible. Can't use Sam's Club's gas station. Quick trip and then stay on this road. 